Joining us from 905 Monroe Avenue, we have the Center for Youth. And from 259 Monroe Avenue, we have Trillium. Welcome to Highland Family Planning Presents Community Quarrel and your host, Jess Coleman! <laughs> Welcome everyone to Highland Family Planning Presents Community Quarrel! <laughs> Alright, today we have two wonderful agencies with us. We have Trillium! <laughs> We surveyed a hundred Rochesterians. Top six answers on the board. What STD would you least like to acquire? HIV. HIV. Number one answer. Would you like to pass or play? Play. Play? Alright, they're gonna play. Woo! They're gonna play. Danny, tell me about your agency. So the Center for Youth Services has a bunch of free services for youth 12 to their 22nd birthday. Um, we have a youth homeless shelter, we have a transitional living program, uh, street outreach goes out into the community um, and talks to youth and other community service members about the services the Center for Youth has to offer. We also do preventive education and we have school-based services. That's awesome. And what's your role at the Center for Youth? I am the street outreach program coordinator. Very nice. Colin, I know, what's your role for the Center for Youth? Uh, I'm in prevention, prevention education services, so I go to different schools and um, jails or any place that is a youth organization and deliver prevention services. Very nice. You're doing, you're doing good work. All right. Repeat the question. What STD would you least like to acquire? Uh, herpes. Herpes. Do we have herpes? All right. All right, and we have Darcy. Hi. Darcy, tell us about your role at the Center for Youth. Um, I work in the street outreach team, and I also work for an agency, like part of our agency is Safe Harbor, which involves sex trafficking and survival sex, things like that. Okay. All right, Darcy, tell us, what STD would you least like to acquire? I'm going to go with gonorrhea. Gonorrhea. Do we have gonorrhea? about your role at the Center for Youth? Um, I'm a workforce navigator. I work in the Learn to Earn department where we help kids get ready to enter the workforce and either finish or further their education. Very, so important, so important. That's awesome. All right. What STD would you least like to acquire? Syphilis. Syphilis. Syphilis up there? Syphilis. All right. Amanda, can you tell us about your role at the Center for Youth? I am the MSW intern working with um, our social worker, Melinda, in the Runaway and Homeless Youth Program. Very nice. And what school are you from? Roberts Wesleyan. All right. Very nice. Okay, Amanda, what do you think 100 Rochesterians would say? What STD would you least like to acquire? I'm going to go with crabs. Crabs. Do we have crabs? <laughs> All right. We got two more answers on the board. <coughs> Danny. One strike, what do you think? What STD would you least like to acquire? I'm gonna say chlamydia. Chlamydia, is chlamydia up on the board? Hmm. Chlamydia is up there, all right. One more left, what do you think? What STD, Colin, would you least like to acquire? I'm trying to think. Quickly, quickly. I'm blanking on, on uh... On what STDs? I mean, all the ones that are up there are ones I really don't want. <laughs> all right, Darcy, it's riding on you. I'm gonna say trichinosis. All right, trichinosis. Is it up there? Oh, I'm sorry. Nice job. Trillium gets a chance to steal. Jonathan, what STD would you least like to acquire? We're gonna say HP. HPV, is it General up there? Wards. Center for 
Harper Youth gets the points. Good job. Yay! <laughs> what do we have left on the board? Any of them. At the end of round one, the score is Trillium Zero, Center for Youth 80. Be sure to check out these resources on sexually transmitted infections. Tune in next week for round two.